Hey guys, um, this is Jack here, and I'm going to be reviewing COGS, which is a new iPhone puzzle game application. Um, sorry for a blurry camera, it's, my camera is uh, constantly auto-focusing. So that, that was the icon. Mm. So it's 99 cents, and it's really fun. And um, there's been mixed reviews about it. For, for example, people say it's good as Enigma. Enigma, uh, Enigma 2, but some people say it's worse, you know. So let's just, uh, enable Crystal. It's just like open faint, so. So it's just registering for Crystal, I'm sorry. Um, let's just play the game. Let's close that. So you can inventor mode. I don't know what that is. I, I don't know what that does. Maybe it's um a mode to make your own little level. So let's just go to how to play. Shows you some cool little animations of how to play. Uh, I think I'm just going back to hold. It's just the same thing. So let's go and play inventor mode. So it's really new. T it's a good take on um, puzzle games. So let's see. Yay! So that's how you, that's, that's just a demo of, of one, you know, this is what this of a solution, how much time it took me, and how many moves. I'll continue. I'll just do one more before I review it. Three dimensions. Alright, so dimensions, you have a 3D um, object I have to do, so that's kind of more, that's a little more interesting. Alright. How do you move? Oh, there you go. Use. Oops. Oops. Huh. Oh, smooth that one. There you go. And it's solved. So I imagine these the difficulties of these puzzles get more challenging, yeah, bigger or you know more faced, uh, more sides of of a 3D object. So you move them. I figured out by moving it with two fingers. That's how you move the object. Um, and that's just a you know demonstration. I could do one more, and then I'll review. Cause this this is really fun actually. Now you have to do with gas. Hmm. You can move things around. Uh, let's see if I can solve this. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know how to solve this. This is fail. time here too. Uh hmm. How do you turn it though? Oh, that that's how you do it. So shift this up. No, you have to move this one. Hmm. 
All right, I'm, I give up. I'm just going to stop right there since I'm wasting too much of you guys' time. So I'm going to quit and uh, go back. Let's see what other options you have. Options. So you can adjust your the FX, the, like the effects of the cogs moving and gas, hissing sounds and stuff like that, or your music, which is basically the background music. Um, you have achievements, which is instead of using open faint, th these guys developed their own uh, something called crystal. And, uh, you know, chronometrist, apprentice, cogsmith, stuff like that. These all these little achievements. So, so similar open faint. Challenge mode, I bet it's probably just um, you give you a puzzle and you have to challenge yourself or challenge a friend or something like that. So that's just a little demonstration of COGS and TOPS. You know, if you see that COGS, kind of a neat way of you know, making their logo. Great background music, very intuitive gameplay. It's very, it's not, it's very challenging actually. You saw me, I was fumbling around with that one, but maybe I'll just uh, try it again when I'm in the car later on. Um, so th thanks guys for watching this video. It's a demonstration of, uh, um, of the application called COGS. 99 cents app store right now. Great game, highly recommended. Very challenging and intuitive. Um, great buy for ni 99 cents. Thanks guys for watching. I'll see you guys next time.